Okay, good morning, everybody. My name is Scott Godey. I'm the Vice President of Product Management and Marketing here at Azaleas, and I'd like to welcome everyone to another Azaleas webinar. Today, our topic is Link, Microsoft's newest unified communication server product and the successor to the current Office communication server product. And uh, with me today, talking uh, and fulfilling the, the role of uh, the expert is our own Azaleos, Jeff Colvin, who is the Principal Unified Communications Consultant and Microsoft Certified Master uh, on Office Communication Server and soon to be Link. The Azaleos webinars, and, and just to, to give you the, a feel, I'm going to sort of play the role of Master Ceremonies today, as well as give you a brief overview of, of Azaleos at the beginning of, of the conference. Um, and then uh, turn it over to Jeff. But a few pointers about our webinars. Our Azaleos webinars are purposefully only 30 minutes in time and duration, so we can give you some great info nuggets and then get you back to your work day. Uh, we'll have about, oh, 20 minutes, 25 minutes or so of presentation and, and hopefully leave some time at the end for some questions. If you do come up with questions during the course of the webinar, please um, go ahead and go to the, the UI there, the Q&A UI, type in your question, and uh, we'll sort of accumulate the questions and then uh, get to them at the end of the presentation. If we don't, we will come back to you offline after the presentation and, and answer your questions. Uh, and then finally, for those of you that join late or, or think this is a, a good uh, uh, 30 minutes of time well spent, uh, we take all of our webinars, package them up into on-demand content and have them available from our website about 24 hours after the webinar. So you can feel free to go back and listen to it again or, or point friends and colleagues to the website to get that information. Okay, so let's keep moving. What is our webinar all about today? Um, five key topic areas, and, and there's a lot of uh, information within each of these. Uh, where to start, how to grow, how do you start getting into and thinking about a, a link um, environment, a link rollout and, and migration. GreenLink, what is the virtualization story for Link? How does that change from Office Communication Server? Number three, don't mock me. Mock being the Microsoft Office client, uh, Office Communicator client. Uh, no longer call that. It's now the Link client. But what does this new unified Link client look like? What does it do? Uh, what's the UI experience like for the end user? Four, controls the state of mind. Uh, you as an admin, uh, potentially what advantages does Link give you to manage that environment once it is uh, rolled out and, and deployed? And then finally, this notion of PBX replacement. Is it time to really think about uh, replacing your PBX? Can Link be that PBX replacement for you? We'll give you some sort of some ideas of, of what the functionality uh, enabled by Link is and, and whether or not you can really think about that as a alternative for your environment. I encourage you to stick around to the end of that half hour because we will be doing a drawing for people still on the line for a, a free link assessment, uh, about $10,000 worth in value. So it behooves you to stick around. First, uh, before we get to the, the technical content, a few bits of information about Azaleas. We've been around for about six years or so. Started out here in Seattle, Washington, where uh, I am based where our headquarters is and uh, expanded about a year and a half ago to a secondary office in Charlotte, North Carolina. We started off as an exchange company primarily, but we've since expanded to cover OCS, Link, uh, Unified Communications, Active Directory, and, and SharePoint as well. We're one of Microsoft's top partners in the U.S., and we have some pretty key OEM relationships with both Verizon Business as well as IBM uh, companies that uh, a few of you may have heard of more than you've heard of Azaleos at least. And these are companies that OEM our service, so they resell our services, our managed services, as part of their overall package. Uh, as a company, Azaleos resells the Microsoft BPOS, or now renamed Office 365. We also resell EMC and NetApp storage, IBM Dell hardware, uh, a number of different semantic and Quest services and tools as well. In terms of what we do, think about us as a remote monitoring and management company for that Microsoft UC stack, including Exchange, Active Directory, Link, and SharePoint, as well as some ancillary add-on services that you see listed there on the right side of the page as well. We're all about a 24 by 7 proactive service, so we essentially act as a, as a turnkey outsourced IT portion 
of your entire IT for, uh, uh, services force taking care of those key workloads, exchange, email, um, telephony, instant messaging, conferencing, and, and certainly all the document management and collaborative aspects that SharePoint brings to the table. We um, also have uh, uh, the ability to install these either, either as a physical or a virtual system, and we have all the sort of security and SAS 70 and, and uh, compliance environment issues that you would want to look at for a company uh, built into our services. In terms of why we matter, there's a, a ton of things that sort of led to our formation as a company six years ago and continue to make us even more relevant today. As an IT department, we hear that you're trying to sort of get out of the email plus business, look to get uh, into more higher value IT type of applications, we can come in and, and turn the crank and really make sure that emails are always up and running, your SharePoint environment is always up and running, et cetera, and allow you to move some of those IT resources across to different sort of higher value line of business applications and infrastructure. Certainly IT is overworked, underpaid. How can we make sure we always have people sitting in our network operations centers in Seattle and Charlotte in a 24 by 7 basis, keeping these environments and these workloads always up and running, keeping them patched, keeping them hot fixed, keeping them upgraded, and, and providing our best commentary on when it's time to upgrade to a new version or, or upgrade to that uh, next service pack. Uh, 2010, this whole Wave 14 that Microsoft has been rolling out that started with Exchange 2010 almost a year ago, has proceeded through SharePoint and now is just on the cusp next week with the launch of Link Server. How can you get that up expertise to upgrade? Is that something you want to invest in as an IT organization, or can, you, can that be something that we can invest in for you so that you can subsequently reap the advantages of the functionality without having to invest in the training and the six-digit uh, administration, sysadmin fees for these various products. We give you uh, kind of all, almost all the benefits of a pure hosted system without many of the disadvantages, um, particularly from a, a cost perspective. And we give you location, lack of risk, and um, control of all your data. And just to emphasize here, our system does not mean that we're a hosted system. We allow you to host that information, <coughs> as we put in the in the last Who We Serve section here, either on your corporate premise, in a private cloud somewhere, or in a colo data center somewhere. So this is not a hosted system. You decide where you want your data, where you want your private cloud, if you will, to be located, and we enable it for you, and then manage it and monitor it for you on a regular basis. We are primarily targeted at 5,000 so seat and up companies, but we um, also begin to be price competitive at about 1,000 users and up. So just depending on what sort of environment you are, we can usually fit as long as it doesn't get below 1,000 users where that, at that point it becomes uh, a little harder just from a pure cost standpoint to compete against some of the up-and-coming um, hosted clouds, public cloud services such as Office 365, formerly called BFOS. So if I move on then uh, and really emphasize again the Azaleos package, it's all about those remote managed services buttressed then by the operations and expertise giving you these 24 by 7 experts around Link, around Exchange, around SharePoint, around Active Directory sitting in our network operations centers. We certainly give you the opportunity if you show, should like to purchase hardware, either server or SAN solutions from us. Uh, we have some pretty aggressive retail reseller and pricing. And then professional services, although it's a smaller part of our company, we do provide you a lot of guidance on the uh, architectural building, the migration and the deployment of the, um, excuse me, I should reverse those, the deployment and the migration of these systems before our core managed services kick in. In, ter in terms of what we see and what you see, we have two different type of portals. The upper one on the upper left there is uh, sort of the ugly portal that all of our network operations center personnel utilize to look at all kinds of data, not data about what's in the email or what's in the uh, IM conversation in the case of Link, but data relating to the system so that we can make sure we, we keep them in top performance and, and running in, in the way they need to be. But also um, then on the lower right, what we call our, our CIO portal, giving you the uh, 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 lead-in view of what the top-level 
uh, data points are relating to your system. So you can sort of look over the shoulder of our network operations center technicians and really understand how your environment is faring and make sure that we're doing the job that we uh, are being paid to do. Of course, you would know if the system was up or down, but this really gives you a, a, a dashboard level CIO type of picture of what's going on with your systems. A quick We've got a, a ton of customers in most of the verticals. Uh, probably our, our two most successful verticals are banking slash financial services as well as healthcare. But as you can see, we really span the globe and have some pretty big names in terms of Chiquita, the fruit company, uh, ATI, uh, Pentair, large water and uh, uh, distribution system in the Midwest, Alcon, a, a large uh, pharmaceutical company in, in the South Central. So there's a ton of companies, uh, a lot of seats, some very large Fortune 500 type of companies that are customers of ours. Enough of the, the marketing spiel and, and who we are. I want to turn it over to Jeff Colvin. As I mentioned before, Jeff is our Unified Communications Principal Consultant and, and one of the, the few Microsoft Certified Master uh, technicians focusing in on unified communications and OCS and link in specific. I'll turn it over to Jeff and let him take you through the rest of the presentation. Jeff, over to you.